Okay, let's go. Everybody in? A farmhouse, probably about 150 years old. we have an outdoor sports center that we're going to check out today. Oh, have Louis. I'll get oh, back to this one. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So here it is. Hello. Sumimasen. Tickets as well. You know it's going to be on film. Oh, yeah, Daima. Sumimasen. There's a lot of mountain bike. There's a lot of Sumimata. Yeah. So he's pulling out a cross bike for me, which I want to test out today. So today we're riding these Miata electric assist bikes. Uh, there's a motor in here, uh, electronic controls could take you up the hills, along the river, wherever you need to go. All right, ready? Let's go. Okay, let's go. your house yesterday morning. So this Zen temple is called Shoujuan. Uh, it's uh, historically important for Zen in Japan. Uh, also very pretty. It's been here since the 17th century. So let's go check it out. It's really nice. That's really cool. Look at the come-up. It doesn't feel so good. Mm, yeah. So this is the kitchen? Right? Yeah, they would have had, they would have had tea here probably. This is where you cook? You know what I mean? Come and go. Everybody in? All right. That's, that's pretty good. <laughs> okay, let's go. Woohoo! I didn't turn on my engine. Yeah. I like this one. This is the one you always go to. Uh, so this is Shonen Chi okay, and they have okay, beautiful yeah. maple leaves. What is this part? Yeah, I think the last time the last time we've been here was kind of on the late side of the leaves. No. Seeing a lot of color. In another week this will be all completely red and yellow, but uh, it's still looking pretty nice. The yeah. yeah. trees is growing. Look at that tunnel there. That's how is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's then you can, okay, we have to get better? low. <laughs> ah! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Okay, so we've arrived at the Hananoi 
Tsukumagawa. So this is our road stop station. So this is basically the local farmer's market for Iyama. So they sell lots of great fresh fruit and vegetables. Famous Iyama product, Nano Hana. Uh, it's uh, an element in canola oil, but you can eat it on its own. Uh, you can cook it up, it's really nice. I always come here in the morning to buy. Yeah, me too. Yeah. So good. Yeah. Good practice. <laughs> <laughs> nice. For all that. Yeah. Oh, good. Can you <laughs> So this is like the larger versions of the nozawana uh, that we saw in there. Uh, it's, people pickle them and eat them all winter because of course it's really snowy here, long winters, so to get the vegetables in the winter it's sort of pickled vegetables like this. <laughs> it's this big. <laughs> So this is a farmhouse, probably about 150 years old. It's been fully renovated and now it's uh, one of the best restaurants in town. Okay, so there's a traditional earth floor, an uh, open hearth, uh, and inside is, is the dining area. They really put a lot of work into this place, it's beautiful. So Hatano does a kaiseki tasting menu. It's a traditional multi-course meal. Every dish is a work of art. Uh, the chef gets a lot of the uh, ingredients from in the mountains, you know, mountain vegetables. Um, it's, uh, it's amazing. I just ate the ginkgo nut, and it's um, usually it's quite bitter, but it's really nice and sweet and soft. And it's a really great flavor. All right. Yeah, no, no, no. A soup with a kabocha pumpkin uh, dumpling shaped into the form of a pumpkin. <laughs> So this is the sashimi course. It's locally farmed salmon and catfish. The catfish has been aged at room temperature. And this is the soy sauce. It's a foam rather than a liquid. Oh, it's so pretty, the shape. Wow. Mm. So in this dish, there are apples and salmon baked in layers with some river fish eggs on top. 
Yeah, so this is a real highlight of the course. It's a uh, homemade tofu deep fried in the broth. Uh, this time it's got uh, some mushrooms in it. Um, it's really delicious. Rice with ginkgo nuts and chestnuts and miso soup with pickles. Mm -hmm. So this is a local Iyama rice. Um, this is one of the best rice growing regions in Japan. So uh, yeah, if you get to eat the local rice, it's always good. So I hope you've enjoyed our little trip around Iyama today. There's just so much to do in this place. We really love it. Uh, you can enjoy the nature. There's really good food, lots of activities to enjoy. So hope that you can check it out yourself sometime. Thank you. Come discover Yama!